Greenwood police released body cam video of a man being tased 16 times. Tonight they say that man's death is not their fault. 30-year-old Charlie Tadero died after spending weeks in a coma. His family called for answers and information in his death. CBS 4's Jill Glavin has viewed that entire video. She's in our newsroom now to tell us more about this tragic case and what actually happened. Jill. Well, this is a complicated and understandably emotional situation. The family says they don't get why officers used a taser. Officers say they had no choice. I want to stress police gave us this video today saying they want to be transparent, but some of you might find it hard to watch. Our officers have done nothing wrong. Two days after the family of a Greenwood man spoke out, Chief John Lout called us to the police station, releasing video, audio, and reports in an effort, he says, to clear the department's name. 30-year-old Charlie Tadero died over the weekend. He had been in a coma for nearly two weeks. I talked to his brother, James. There's like a black hole. You know, there's missing information. What happened to, to Charlie? To fill that hole, the chief gave us two body camera videos. Both are from May 29th, after two people called 911 to report Tadero walking in and out of traffic, seeming incoherent. The video picks up after Lieutenant Brian Blackwell first got there and used his taser. On one video, you can hear the taser being used again as officers try to get to Darrow in handcuffs on the ground. You want medic, sir? Yes. In total, that officer deployed his taser 16 times. Some of those times, a prong was stuck into Darrow's shirt and not working right, according to Lout. He says Darrow was not listening or complying, instead holding a Bible in his hand as he claimed to be Jesus Christ. It's Charlie. No, Jesus doesn't act like this. I'm through. I'm a Since Charlie Tadero was 13 years old, there have been 53 incidents, interactions with the police, and I believe 15 criminal arrests. His last arrest was in 2013, and his brother told me he was turning his life around. He says Charlie's dad had just died, and he believes he was distraught. I just don't believe that my brother had to die for this. Despite that, Loud says he stands behind his officers and believes an autopsy will show Tadero did not die because of that taser. Now that autopsy is not done yet, but the chief said a medical examiner called Tadero's death natural caused by liver disease and hepatitis C, which made his brain swell. Tadero's family has hired a lawyer and tell me they are focused on saying goodbye to their brother right now. Live in the newsroom, Joe Glavin, CBS 4 News.